Tutorial number 10, I will show you how to show lattice plane in a unit cell. So let's open the Vista software. Go to the file. Click open. Here I have CIF file of sodium chloride. This CIF file is downloaded from COD website. If you are new to my channel, then do check out my previous video in which I have shown how to download CIF file and also how to get the Vista software. The links are given in the description box. So let's select the file. Click open. Now we can see a unit cell of sodium chloride. Here I don't want to see the bond and this extra atom. So how to remove them? Just go to the edit. And then over here you will find option for the bond. So click over here. And this is the bond. Okay. So this is the unit cell of sodium chloride. Now let's go and click on edit. Over here you will find option for the lattice plane. Click over here. In the bottom window you can click new. And this is the HKL100 plane. And the color is a green color. So if you move the unit cell, you can see this is along the x-axis, which can also be visible from the this compass. So this is pointing toward the A. So this is the 100 plane. If you want to change the color, you can simply click over here and choose any different color you want. So it will change the color. If you want to change the transparency, this is using this number you can change the transparency let's set it to 50 or set it as 150 okay so for my convenience i keep it 100 now let's see if you want to move this plane so how to do that one you need to change this value either d or the distance from origin so let's try 0.5 and see where it is now is in the center Let's make it zero. So it's at the beginning. That's the origin point. Now you can show a different plane in similar unit cell. How to do that one? Click on new. This time maybe I will use another color, a blue color. I keep the same transparency. And let's select second plane. So this is the plane. Over here you can see a plane. Very tiny plane, right? Because the, your D is zero. Let's move D to 0.5 and see so this is the plane which is cutting this atom let's move it to 1 so it's become perfectly diagonal okay now let's see a new plane uh, okay click on new and change it to 111 so this is a new plane and I will give a different color let's select a green color okay so I want it to be at d equal to 1. Perfect. So now we can see three different planes. Let's put one more plane at the end. So new and this time change color to black. And uh, this plane I want to be 0, 0 and add d equal to 1 perfect so this is how we can show different plane in the same unit cell i hope through this video you learn how to show plane in a unit cell if it has helped you then do like share and subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon button